My question to the uh, Secretary General is this. Yes. That yes, on one hand, there are issues of corruption and those are um, Tax realities. evasion of 137 those billion. Those are realities that but the country about, is dealing with. We're talking however, about an addition of 50 billion. You think it is a lot of money? These the are question peanuts. is this. Already one sector, one, okay, public servants are taking 10% of the budget. If every other, then, you know, public servant, every other, say, like doctors, the nurses come out and claim, will you have all of the recurrent expenditure then that has been a wage bill question and issue that the country has human been with. capital is a human capital is a key engine to driving the economy of the country and uh, developing some economic theories that do not work but we want to gridlock that the wage of workers should not exceed this number whereas those workers deserve decent pay so that they can be productive to the economy is, is a dangerous uh, school of thought. Mm -hmm. The court has given direction, and the court was created for that purpose, and is a competent court, uh, manned by competent churches who are vast with economic realities. This ruling was not given in a vacuum. Someone must have considered the economic capacity of this country. Let's look at the current budget of this year. Government will spend 2.2 trillion but the marginal increase for this workforce, which of course is the largest workforce in any, in any government, is only 50 billion shillings. 